This is like the mountain of Mordor. Lord have mercy, we got a lot of This might not be in order, I don't think. Holy <laughs> Ah, it's a lot of crap. I didn't think that for it. This haul is the most epic makeup, cosmetics, you name it haul I've ever done. The boxes are damaged because I put them in the car and it one of the boxes gave way. Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Do you have any idea how excited I am to open these two boxes? I had a lot of points. And we all know Revolution is my favourite brand because first of all, it's very affordable. Second of all, it's fantastic for my skin. It's seeming to be okay with my skin. I'm obsessed with their skincare as well. I did a video testing the skincare. Anyway, I have no idea what's in here because you know me, when I do my hauls, I forget what I've bought. I know a lot of you going to go, oh my God, Jesus, not another Revolution haul. I love Revolution. Today was either Shia all try on video I'm gonna be doing. I'm probably gonna do that tomorrow because the weather's gonna be better tomorrow because outside at the moment the weather's really pants considering it's June. Our weather's really pants at the moment. Anyway guys, let's get started with the haul. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give me a big fat thumbs up and also do not forget to subscribe to my channel and then press on that bell to get all the notifications. This is like the mountain of Mordor. Right, okay, so we're gonna start with the little one like we always do. It's closed editions. We always start with the little pot. If you don't know, Revolution does collabs with like Disney. This might not be in order, I don't Thing. Holy <laughs> ah, it's a lot of crap. Thinking collection highlighter in the colour of Heart of a Lioness. This is going to be the bloody battle of all battles here. Get it out of this box. Oh, it's cute. Oh, it's a nice colour. I like this colour. It's more of a peachy beige than what I thought it would be. But I actually like that. That's going to be really nice for the winter, actually. I like to collect all sorts of things. I like this because it's actually really pretty. This is going to be nice even just to, like, display. Even for a Disney fan, this is going to look amazing. This is in the colour called Love Story. And I'm really into, like, pinks and nudes at the moment. It's got speckles of silver glitter in there. Wow. It doesn't have a scent. I'm a bit disappointed with that. Oh, yeah. This is really pigmented. That's a full coverage lip gloss. Coming up next. We've got the palette named Jungle Princess. Finally out of the box. Took me 10 minutes called Jungle Princess. That's cute. I'm not gonna swatch these because I actually do really want to use it for like later in the year. So we got um we got main gal, nice bright baby blue. Got the Royale, which is a nice like matte lilac. Right hand is a nice like sheeny, limey, olivey colour. We got Queen, which is this really nice, beautiful. I think it's gonna be a matte with a slight sheen kind of lavender colour. We got Lioness, which is like a really nice olive green there. We got Best Frame, which is this nice grass green colour. We got True Love, which is a really nice, like beigey base. Got elephant graveyard which is nice emerald green and uh, we got sarah Finn up which is this nice camel color how cute is that this just for a gift as well this would be absolutely fantastic this is in the eyeliner collection called three best friends look at that how cute this is so cute look at it i'm not sure whether they're crown eyeliners or tip felt tip eyeliners We've got different colors so hopefully fingers crossed these will be the colors wow so we've got the pink one. Oh my god I mean that and that together with a big pink and yellow look. Oh my god. Look at this neon green here. Okay, so that was the Lion King collection that I got. Absolutely love it. The lip gloss, I mean, come on. The lip gloss is just going to be amazing. Once I get the niche of those eyeliner pens, it will work out really well, I think. Anyway, let's not doodle because we have got a lot of doodle to go through. So this is the Revolution Create a Ring Light Mirror. I just need one for my room. I'm doing my makeup and I'm away for a weekend and I need like a nice bit of lighting. I do generally need nice, flat, compact, lit up mirror to use and like on the go. I think this was on sale. I think it was for like a fiver and I thought for a fiver this is quite good value. Oh this is a really good stand. So they come in these nice little LED lights. It does need battery so I'm gonna have to get good old dad. If it breaks it's only a fiver so seven years bad luck but <laughs> at least it was only a fiver. <gasps> I wanted to get these for ages so I can't remember what brand it was. They did these hair slinky silk things that you used to wind your hair up on and clip it all in. Revolution did that but unfortunately they were all sold out. I was gutted. There's some more suggestions and this was on sale because I read up if you've got things like psoriasis or rosacea or something like that you can get flare ups and the bacteria on your pillow. So this is Revolution Beauty Sleep Satin Pillowcase, a satin eye mask and a scrunchie. Look at the scrunchie. We've got the eye mask there. I haven't used the eye mask in years. It's got wool inside. It's really super like soft. I was gonna go for a company but I was not gonna pay £65 for a pillowcase. Nah. But Revolution do a dupe and I'm always gonna go for the dupe as long as it's cheaper because I'm a cheap ass. 
that's it. Oh my gosh, they got the whole logo on the pillowcase. And I love as well how it comes in a baggie because if you're going away, I remember it was less than 10 quid. It was on sale because of my skin condition. I'm really, really, really cautious with my brushes. So this is a solid brush cleaner. Now, I've never seen this before. Bought two of these. Oh, it's weird. Look at it. So it's just solid white soap. Instantly sanitizes, cleanses, and conditions. I remember getting this, and this was only like a pound. This is a poor cleansing brush. How cute is this? I don't know how you use one of these, because I've never used these before. It's a tiny little brush. I'm going to basically look up on a tutorial on how to use it. There was really good reviews on this, actually. So it would be interesting to give a go. Some days, I just don't want to use scrubs, because or no strips. I only use a no strip once a week. And scrubbing, I do with a scrub, like, every Every two to three days because my skin can't handle it. I remember this. So this is called Midnight Kiss Lipstick. Smooth velvet finished lipstick with a skull ring. Now, you know me. Any weird looking lipstick, I'll buy it. Oh no. Well, that's not good. When I saw the advert, it was jet black. Oh my. It doesn't have a scent. And this is a little ring. <laughs> Come on, how cool is that? And I love how it's got a little skull on top. I love a nice lipstick colour during Halloween times. And normally I do purple. I want to try black a couple of times. Just for fun. Just for a couple of Instagram. Well, I needed this. Look how cute it is. This is a bow headband, obviously. Can't get it out the case. Now I'm stressed. <gasps> oh my god, it's so soft. And my one was rotten, so I had to chuck it away. I have one of their samples during Christmas time. Nice, this is the most sweet. It, it reminded me of Juicy Couture, but I can't remember the name of it. And it was a little sample. I lost it when we went away last week of Vlogmas. And I love these ones because these are really good for your clutch bag as well. And if you really do love it, you can get the big one to keep at home. This is called Revolutionary Noir. Noir? I'm not gonna bother. <laughs> Oh my god, this is the one! It's sweet, it's spicy, oh my god. It does remind me of Juicy. I think it was either Juicy or Gucci, one of the really old ones. <gasps> this is pretty! I didn't even know I actually bought this. <laughs> this is the Revolution lip gloss in the colour called Hope. I love as well how like there's a really nice butterfly. That must have been why I went for it. Pretty! Look how cute it is! Know me, I'll probably, even if like I use the product up, I'll probably like refill it with another lip gloss. This is something nice to probably just put on like during the day. Or a quick top up, like a nice sheen metallic -y top up. It's pretty, I like it. Not too sticky, it's perfect. Hey guys, no, I get these multiple times. These are the lashes in the design named Doll. They're a nice, wispy. You know me, I like to buy lashes on the cheap because I generally think to myself, what's the point in wearing them three times and chucking them if you're going to pay like 30 quid for a pair of lashes? I'm, um, nah. Oh, we got some lipsticks. Now, obviously, you lot know that I absolutely love the Friends from Revolution palette and the Phoebe lipsticks I've had in the past. So I've got as many as I could get. Look at it, how cute. So I've got the shades Rachel, Phoebe and Monica. These were the only ones that I could get, so maybe these were the only shades, but I know there was, I know there was a lip gloss called Chandler because my mate's got it, but I couldn't find it, unfortunately. I mean, I'm more of a lipstick or a liquid lip than a lip gloss kind of girl. Out comes Monica. Monica, I love it when they do this, when they've got things like that because then you can actually see the true shade. Ooh. She's pretty. Coconut scented. My shade that is. I'll be using that at a daily basis. Now we are going to open Fibo. Oh my god guys, look at this nice purpley maroon red. Again, I'm not going to swatch these because I actually am going to use these like, probably I'm going to use Monica now and then I'll probably move on to this like during the autumn time. Now Rachel, I think Rachel's going to be very simple nude because the other products I've seen of hers, they're quite simple nude. It's a very nice nude. But there she is there. So you can see there it says Rachel. Pop her open. Standing up together. Like that on your lipstick case storage place. I love collecting things like this because like, I grew up with friends. I'm a big die hard friends fan. This is the Revolution Pro Diamond Luster lipstick in the shade called Lullaby. This is something like your mum would have had like in the 90s and early 2000s and you'd nick it and take it to school with you. <gasps> Literally what? Look at it! It smells very floral. It's not as glittery as I thought it was, but it's still very, very metallic. And this reminded me of a lipstick that my mum used to have, and I used to nick it and take it to primary school. <laughs> it reminded me of one. We got a book. <laughs> Basically, want to collect some like nice designer books and some nice like books to like display. This is the book called Influencer Overnight. I love the cover. This is gonna be really nice to display. I love the fonts. I love the little stars on it, and I thought this would just be generally really nice to display. Brushes are grimy, going bald now. 
we needed some new ones. Again with the Overnight Influencer full bead brush set. So this is a 10 piece brush set and brush roll. So it actually has its own case. That's why I liked it because it's a lot more sanitary, especially when you're going away. This was a bit more expensive. So this is synthetic hair. Oh, that's why I like it because I don't like goat hair. I don't like real hair. And to roll it back in, it looks like this with the bow. <gasps> Oh, that's beautiful, and then you tie it this side into a little book. Oh, maybe that there was a load of content creators that maybe got together, but I just looked at this and I thought, this is really nice. I don't know, maybe it has something to do with the book as well, because it looks like the book. So I'm going to read the book and see if it tells you any information. This is a Hydro Bank Ice Facial Roller. Keep in fridge. Oh me, I'm a huge believer in law of attraction. You know, I'm a huge believer in affirmations. They've done a collection with affirmations. It says I am enough. It's one of my favorite quotes. I lost my office job a year ago, over a year ago now, I think. And on the way home, there was that one affirmation that stuck to my head, so I kept repeating it over and over again, saying I am enough. And then the next day, Serene and Kaylee took me to Brighton for the day. I bumped into a jewelry, small indie brand. Like, she was on, she was on like a kiosk. The first ring that I saw on this kiosk that literally blew my mind it said i am enough on it quite honest i never normally say i'm enough but now i do because i know that was definitely a sign to start saying it more often so this is inner design with a little ta little tracks are called talented unique and strong oh my god i love this oh my god i've got a friend that's like feeling down and loves makeup i think that's a really nice gift i love all these like really nice like nude taupe mats into like this nice orange that says i'm courageous love that i am unique i'm not my mistakes i am compassionate i am proud of myself i am a positive present i'm successful i am talented i am courageous oh my god i love that this was actually quite cheap so i was the other two this is the palette called i choose me so it's in this really really nice like candy shop display all the jars of candy all have like one word affirmations on there valuable confident worthy hopeful talented successful and proud i love that <gasps> oh look at that and these colors you got i choose joy I am worthy, which is one of my favourite quotes. I choose my own path. I am magical. I am a priority. You are. I'm bold. I choose me. I choose healthy habits. The colours as well, I'll definitely, definitely be using these colours. So this is the I Heart Revolution Self Love Club. Very 60s. It's very cool. And you've got like the spray paint that's like spreading out your... <gasps> Look at those colours. My own love is enough one of a kind my own best friend part of the process i accept myself small process is progress i am a priority i deserve self-care so this is the i heart revolution love elixir lip oil and this is in the color love pomegranate it's like a potion bottle you can tell it's very moisturizing but it's not sticky i'm almost out of the fruit pebbles one and i couldn't get that they were actually sold out so this is my new one to pop into my fridge i love the casing as well and you could also reuse this as well so it's a win-win. The first box is empty. Oh my god, there's a lot of crap in here. Because I'm actually out of this. So this is the Hydration Boost Night Hydration. Nourishing Hydrating Cream. Yeah, so this is literally the same one I've bought twice already. I have run out of my second part, so that's for a top up that's gonna go straight into the fridge now i know why i bought this for like when i'm exfoliating for like fake tan reasons the reason why i went for the silicone one was because i knew it wasn't gonna like hurt my skin lord have mercy we got a lot of <laughs> it also stuck up makeup obsession and i actually really like that brand i can't find an essence spray that's small enough to fit in my beauty cooler. This is the Makeup Obsession So Dope Nourishing Essence Spritz with CBD. And what my idea was, I looked about, and a lot of people who suffer with plaque psoriasis and like plaque disorders do tend to go with CBD products. It's a hormone balancer. I love this. It looks so, so cool. You can smell it ever so slightly, but it's got more of like a a menthol into it there isn't any instructions of how often to use this but i'm not reacting to it so boring on me it's not that interesting i did need a new beauty blender I've used one of these before from revolution they're quite nice and bouncy unfortunately i think it's going to be a little bit too big for my fridge which i'm gutted but i'll use our fridge Just hopefully mum and dad don't try and eat it you know how many face masks i go through i'll use one like roughly like every other day i do go through a lot of sheet masks it's bad. This is the Planet Revolution Mask Revival Soothing Sheet Mask Water. I'm not gonna lie, it looks like we. Then what are we gonna do for the sheet masks? These are the Planet Revolution Mask Revival Reusable Facial Sheet Masks. 
How cool is that? Rewash it and then you use it again. Soap or spray the reusable facial sheet mask with sheet mask water. Apply sheet, so it does say soak or spray. So it can either be heavy or it can be light. Leave it on to 10 to 15 minutes. So these will be good for in the morning actually. Oh my God, this is like leather face. These are weird, look at them. Got two of these for a few quid. I can still run around and look like leather face and scare the crap out of my mum. These are the free microfiber face cloths just to wash my face with and I just chuck them in the washing machine. These are reusable makeup removal pads in their own wash bag. Get them on the cheap because I can't stand it when you go on these companies and they're charging like 20, 30 pounds for like eight reusable pads. So this is the Revolution CBD Soft Foam Cleanser. So this is the Revolution Skincare London CBD Nourishing Essence Spray. It's very green. That's like alien weed. But I just thought this would be really good to give a go. I think this was only like, again a few quid. I'm hoping I bought a setting spray. I didn't think that for <laughs> I forgot to get set into bro. <laughs> so this is the Revolution Skincare London Nourish Boost CBD Rich Nourishing Cream. I like the design. You already know what you're getting yourself into. It's like whipped cream. Look at that. This is Seed Cut Balm Multi-Use Cream. Helps reduce the appearance of skin redness with soothing organic aloe vera and nourishing shea butter. Look at the tiny bottle. How cute is that? One of the last items. This is Cooling Cucumber Eye Gel. I actually needed one because I've actually just run out of my old one and I've just chucked it in the bin. The Revolution Eye Creams, they are amazing. Oh, it's green. Oh, you can smell cucumber, definitely. But yeah, again, these are really inexpensive. Last item, so this is the CBD Serum. It's for dry skin and it's a nourishing serum. Helps soothe and calm dry skin. Again, uh, very um, cannabis themed. So it's in a nice glass bottle there with a nice pump on it, which is what I like. Oh, guys. That is what a ball. It's a lot. It's not gonna be fun to put away. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that humongous haul. And if you did, please make sure you give me a big fat thumbs up. And please, obviously, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Make sure you press on that bell and turn on all the notifications. And then you will know whenever I'm doing an upload or a community post. Just jump on my Instagram right there, and then I communicate a lot with you guys on Instagram. And obviously, guys, if you've never been here before, I upload on Wednesdays 4 to 5 p.m. And then on Sundays, I upload always religiously on 9 a.m. Wish me luck putting this stuff back. And I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye!